Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. I don't even know why we're doing this. We're back again in our kitchen. Yes, we are. <laughs> yeah, we're making different things tonight because it's uh, minus 30 degrees outside yeah. and uh, Nafi's going to barbecue. So we're going to take advantage and cook up a lot of different meats. I'm going to cook up some salmon as well. And finally, we're going to be cooking up some steak. Okay. This Take one is a separate marinade for Nafi because he put a lot more um, hot peppers in his. I can't remember, to be honest. Uh, <laughs> it's your tomato, a... onion, garlic, tomato, and a few spices. Garlic, <laughs> onion. It's got some of that um, the marinade from the steak and a bit of marinade from the chicken. So kind of throwing it all in yes. for the salmon. Yes, and... Uh, what else? Uh, it, vinegar. It smells really good. It does. Mm, mm -hmm. I should make pizza out of this instead, actually. <laughs> no, it's for the yeah. salmon. Go ahead. That's it. I'm done. It's all good. Oh, I've got holes in it. Yeah. <clears throat> Looking good. Mm -hmm. And you have the skin on the salmon because it's easier to grill that way. So, we're um, a little bit crazy. You can see our breath. <laughs> uh, despite the frostbite warnings, uh, we're out here determined to have a barbecue tonight. We haven't had one in a couple of months. And Nafi actually found uh, some charcoal. And, um, and so we're going to attempt to do this. There we go. That's more like it. We'll be making some Cajun oven roasted potatoes. Yum. We're also having roasted uh, potato fries tonight for supper. It's going to go fantastically with our peri peri chicken. And what I do is, these are just regular red potatoes, but I uh, don't take all of the skin off. I actually leave some of the skin on. It looks nice uh, on the fry, and it's actually, um, uh, it tastes quite nice as well. And so when I cut this up, I'm actually cutting it up into sort of uh, quite big, chunky fries here, as you can see. And I'm going to be battering that in our terrific uh, Cajun spice here. And we're going to be roasting those in the oven. Just move my skins over. Actually, skins are really good as well, just to have if you want to crisp them up as well. As you can see, they are quite chunky, the fries. And I'm just uh, going to continue to cut them up here, sort of random uh, shapes and sizes. Makes them more interesting on the plate. And then we will be putting them in the spices that I've made here. Um, I'll give you the recipe at the end. And these are going to be so amazing. They're not too spicy, not too hot, not too hot rather. And you can make uh, a really nice uh, sour cream dip um, for the potatoes if you want as well. So I'm just going to mix up uh, all of these uh, cut up potatoes here into the delicious spices. Make sure they're thoroughly covered and then we're gonna chuck them in the oven. Okay so I've got them all on my iron plate in the oven and I'm just gonna be drizzling a tiny bit of oil um, over them. Just a little bit so it doesn't stick or excuse me so it just keeps them a little bit moist. And we're going to let them cook for a good 45 minutes. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I can see the fire coming out as well. How's it looking? Oh, much better. It's coming along. How do you feel today in this lucky cold weather? You feel like a man? <laughs> Wearing my gloves, you feel like a man as well? Not 
I'm sure our uh, neighbors, as they come in, think we're absolutely insane to be uh, barbecuing in minus 30 degree weather. I just stepped in because I could see people getting out of their car and I didn't want them to see me. Matthew's talking to the neighbors outside. I haven't started yet. It's taking very long. It's too cold. <laughs> <laughs> How embarrassing! So our fries have been cooking for about 15 minutes and they are looking absolutely incredible. So you're going to put some oil down so the chicken doesn't uh, get stuck. And we're going to put the chicken on first because it's going to take the longest to cook. Chicken. It's been marinating for a couple hours. This is your spicier one. And mine does not have all of the chili spices in it. I like it a little more. Put the salmon um, on top to let it smoke. It still has the skin on it. And why are we doing this? Why are we cooking so much meat? Because uh, we don't plan to barbecue again, probably, for another two months. Uh, so what we do is uh, we're going to be uh, putting these in uh, freezer bags, but they'll keep their flavor for quite a while, so just heat them up in the oven. Oh, it's starting to go up. So, are you freezing? Your nose tells me you're freezing. It's just my nose. Your nose knows. It doesn't know anymore. <laughs> yeah, you you broke it. So, uh, tell me, um, do you think this was a good idea? Yeah. yeah? You're not going to um, tell me you shouldn't have done it? Yeah, that's <laughs> Yeah, we went through this last year, and uh, it uh, it wasn't quite minus thirty. It was snowing. Yeah, like I I just been I've been going out there and videotaping, and my I can't even feel my toes. I, you're oh, I'm talking to Zelda now. The cat, yeah, he's talking to the cat. <laughs> she she feels sorry for me. Look at that. Aw, she loves you. She's worried. Worried? Uh, what? I, I didn't tell you to go out and Making make the barbecue. It is not me. You know it's not. You said today, I want peri peri chicken on the barbecue, and that was final. Yep. Let's hope it comes out nice. Yes, it will. Okay, so they've been cooking for half an hour now, and doing really well. Probably go another 15 minutes. Go check on Nappy. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Okay, if it isn't cold enough out here, you're snacking on some ice cream that you Looks store. Like that. You store it out here because it's colder than our freezer. And uh, why in the world are you eating freezing cold ice cream? This is right there. It's freezing cold outside. You're crazy, Nappy. You are absolutely crazy, honestly. Ugh. So I'm going to be making a sour cream dip here. It could be used uh, in a variety of ways. You can have it for your fish, you can have it for your um, uh, chips that we made, the fries, and uh, you'll also be able to use this for regular crisps. Um, we call them chips here in Canada, a bag of chips, um, crisps. And uh, so what I'm basically doing is I'm just going to add, um, so I put um, about a half a container, uh, half a cup of uh, sour cream. I'm going to add uh, about a tablespoon of um, dill and mix that up. A little less than a quarter of a cup of um, brine from the dill. And I'm going to be mixing that just up. added a whole clove of uh, fresh garlic. Add, uh, again, not quite a full quarter cup of 
lemon juice along with the garlic and the brine from the pickles and the dill. We'll mix that all up. About a teaspoon of salt. That is our dip ready to go for, um, you can use that on uh, for the fish and or to dip your Star french fries of in. my peri peri dressing. Um, I just finished having a bit of a cough because I put the <clears throat> hot peppers in and it just takes my breath away. Anyways, um, my husband loves it really, really hot. So there you have it, just putting the dressings together and I'll have the recipe at the back of the, the video. Uh, ingredients for the peri-peri dressing into the food processor. The dressing came out perfect, very nice, very spicy. Lemon is out from the barbecue and it looks and smells it looks and smells amazing. Wow. Mm, nice and moist. Delicious. It's good. Looks amazing. Okay, so our roasted fries are done. Um, spicy, delicious. Perfect with the sour cream dip. The steak uh, also came out very, very nice, very juicy. Pizza triangle here. <laughs> Feel bad for those. Uh, wow, that was good. Yeah. Cooked well. Yeah, you like it like that. I like it medium rare. I feel bad for those vegetarian lovers. Um, they must be looking at us with disgrace right now, eating all this meat. It just came out perfectly and we're gonna sit down and enjoy this meal. It was worth it. We're not sitting down to eat all that meat, just the no, chicken. So Everything else is in. gonna be put into the freezer, but it'll still have that smoky flavor. And it was awesome. Thank you for all no your problem. help. Bye-bye. Masalama. Masalama.